www.newtoboss.com. My name is Ty. Uh, this video is still a part of video tutorial series on Adobe Audition CS6. Uh, for a complete list of the tutorials that we did for Adobe Audition, do we'll look that up on our YouTube channel, uh, New to Works. You can just check that out from there. So right now, what I'd like to share you is how you can convert uh, a WAV file. If you want it converted to a .mov file or a QuickTime file that you'd want to use for probably something else. You have your reason why you'd want to convert that, so I would want to help you with that. What we would want to do first is open up your Adobe Audition CS6 and look up for a file that you would want to convert, which is a .wav or .wav file. Uh, if you're in an edit view right here, you have to just drag it uh, again this is the file all right let me play it for you no no I'm just gonna play it here drag it here straight and play it from there home new to boss treats you for a Valentine pizza party get 20% discount when you order right now plus we're gonna add in two solo pizzas to go with your Valentine's date so what are you waiting for call now all right so that's a file or a raw voice file that we used on one of our video tutorials and how you can create a radio ad if you want to learn about that you can just check that out from the list of videos that we have so right now again the purpose is to just convert this WAV file uh, into a QuickTime or .mov file again just an audio file alright audio only control A on it right click over that you got save selection as or you could also do long way right here file uh, save selection as or another if you are pretty versed with everything that you'd want to do shortcuts or keyboard shortcuts control a to highlight to make sure that you don't leave out any file I mean any audio element then do control alt and s it's gonna bring up save selection as panel I have wave right here All right so it's the container or the current file container of the audio elements that you have in there. So what you want to do with that is pizza, or rename that to whatever file name you would want to use. And as I always suggest, you might want to type in the file container, like mov or .mv3. Why? Because there are computers with hidden file extensions. You can't see a .wave .mv3 on most computers. So just by looking at the file name, you would know right from there that it's actually an MOV file or an MP3 file. Right? So just a suggestion. You can do that or it, it's it's not demanded in converting a file. So I also add a date and pizza MOV 0203.wave. So it's still on a wave container. You go to format right here and change that. Click that and you got something that says QuickTime audio only dot mov again quicktime dot mov click on that and it should change uh, the extension right so it's now on mov so what you want to do is just go straight down right here uh, sorry if you want to change the sample type uh, stereo 32 bit 4400 you can do that here you can change the channel to mono 5.1 it's all up to you but uh, 3268 that's going to be right on that panel to make changes. But again, if you're good with this, you can just click on OK right there. That's going to save that a little bit. Go to your file path. And here is your pizza.mov file. All right, so we're going to play that. Uh, you can play that on QuickTime Player. You can play that on VLC Player. And double click on that. So if you're if you're using Windows 8, then it would say can't play because the item file is not supported. So I guess I'm prepared for that. I have the multi-functional VLC player. VLC player won't let you down in regards to playing media files. You can play FLAC, you can play FLV, and 
Nut Boss, Boss treats you for a Valentine pizza party. Get a 20% discount when you order right now. Plus, we're gonna add in two solo pizzas to go with your Valentine's date. So what are you waiting for? Call now. There you go. So that's how you convert a WAV file into a .mov file for any purpose that you are targeting. Yeah, for some of the video tutorials, you can check out www.newtoboss.com. My name is Ty. Thanks so much for watching.